this morning is probably because you're already smelling some barbecue. The fifth annual Atlanta Barbecue Festival brings both pro and backyard teams to Atlantic Station over the weekend. And Good Day Atlanta's Paul Milliken is already there. I don't know. Are you pretending to be a judge, sampling <laughs> some of the, uh, the fare? Well, I, I am going to sample, but <laughs> not what I'm standing in front of at the moment. Let me tell you something, Gravier. You know I'm going to love this day when, number one, I get a text message at 5 in the morning that says... The lipstick for the pig is on the way. And number two, when the Fox brothers pull up uh -huh. and they say, we just brought Buck's girlfriend. These are my kind of guys right here. <laughs> and uh, there's Foxy. Buck, feast your eyes on Foxy, who will not look like that oh, for much longer soon. And there's there's the lipstick, it, too. No. I mean, I'm telling you, I, I fit right in with these folks. Of course, these are the fantastic Fox brothers. It gets no better in Atlanta barbecue. So first of all, it's great to be here with you guys. And this year for the Atlanta Barbecue Festival, something a little bit different, right? What are you guys doing this weekend? We're doing, uh, we're, we're going to be smoking Foxy here for yeah. a uh, VIP. Oh, poor Foxy. I know. Yeah. Uh, her time is going to be well served. Uh, <laughs> for a VIP experience here at Atlanta, uh, Atlanta Barbecue Fest. Yeah. Uh, tomorrow from 12 to 8, uh, you'll get to enjoy Foxy and all her greatness. Nice. Uh, we have a bunch of sides that we're going to throw out there. Uh, we got a ton of bourbon. You get to hang out and drink with us and yeah. ask us questions, check out what we're cooking. And, uh, I love and it. It's going to be a great day. There is nothing better than that. So Okay, I'm going to start the questions right now. Tell me, but for Foxy, this is a big pig, like 165 pounds. How in the heck do you cook that thing so that she's going to be ready for all these people? Slow and low. It's yeah. going to be a 15-hour process. Uh, we'll start her probably about 8 o'clock tonight. Mm -hmm. uh, she'll be ready around 1 o'clock tomorrow afternoon. Excellent. I'll be first in line. You know, I think it's only fair. I got to see her get lipstick on this morning. I get to taste test first. Hey, this festival has been going on five years now. You've been here for a while. Tell me about the Atlanta Barbecue Festival. Why do folks need to come out to Atlantic Station this weekend. I, you know, it's a Atlanta barbecue, and, and it's a it's a great event for our hometown. Yeah. Uh, it's, it's grown over the years. We've been participating since its inception at uh, Turner Field the first year. Uh, it's it's a fun day to get out and, and, and look at what people are doing and, and look at some of the best barbecue this uh, region has to offer. Yeah, good place to learn and a good place to eat. Thank you guys very much. Cannot wait to try out Foxy. And real quick, we mentioned before, part of the VIP package would be the bourbon tasting. Now, here, I want to make it very clear. What? I did not slur one word <coughs> during uh -huh. that live shot. Uh -huh. So, bosses, mm. there has been no taste testing. Whoa. Oh. I promise. No, even that. That mm -hmm. was not. I, I promise. <laughs> I'm fine. Totally sober this morning. Going to be some good stuff out here again. The Atlanta Barbecue Festival kicks off today. Friday the 13th is a lucky day for me and continues through the weekend. Cannot wait to try some Fox Paul, Brothers barbecue. Paul Yum. Milliken, it's 20 minutes till 10. You're off the clock at 10, right? Yeah, right. and look and look Absolutely. who decided and look who decided to just kind of hang around. I heard my around. name being mentioned, uh -huh. so I had to pop back in here in the studio. Lanford, hey. Lanford, yeah. it was them. It was them. Okay, <laughs> it was they said it right. They said it when I pulled up. They said Buck's girlfriend is here. Buck, she's ready for you. She looks like she maybe had a rough night with the smeared <laughs> lipstick and she got the hat askew. But you tell them I'll no. play along as long as they bring me a Tominator. <laughs> All right, Buck says as long as he gets a sample, he'll go for it. I think we can hook you up. You know, a the Tominator. Fox love I you, want Buck. a Tominator. Tell him I want a Tominator. You got it. You got it. Okay.